want to buy a house here in Central Florida, Orlando, here's why as a buyer you should put in a really, really good offer. It's hard for buyers to emotionally get the feeling of what it's like, just how competitive it is. Because they go out, they see the house, they say, oh, they're asking $400, maybe we can get it for $399. Nope, you probably can't even get it for $400,000. Here's most sellers' experience. I put a home on the market. We have a 10-day marketing period. And during those 10 days, we'll have over 100 showings which means at least 10 showings a day in a 10 or 12 hour day, which means every hour or so someone's out looking at the home. We'll generate 25 to 35 offers. And out of that, at least two or three or four buyers have already made nine or 10 offers on the home. And they're at the point where they say, I don't care. You're asking 400, just tell me what I got to pay. We'll waive the appraisal. We'll waive the inspection. Condition. We'll just buy a home. And why are they doing that? Well, because interest rates are as low as they're going to get ever. Two years ago, people thought prices were really high, 245000 for the average house. And people were saying, oh, I don't want to pay two fifty. dollars I don't want to. It's just so much. I don't want to overpay. Well, that was two years ago, 24 months ago. Now, that same house, two fifty four, is 318000 So you can see when you're at the house today looking at a price like this, it doesn't really matter what you pay within reason because it's going to go to here pretty quickly. When's the best time to buy a home? A couple of years in the past. Or, since we can't buy in the past, best time to buy a home is right now. Buy a house. Buy any house. Buy a house in Orlando, Central Florida. A rental, a house to live in. Don't die. And a couple of years later, you'll feel like a genius. If I can help you in any way, I'm Realtor Scott Garrison with Remax Town & Country.